Hi everyone, welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the crew. I'm Rebecca and today is Tuesday, so it's time to see what is new in the restocked items at the Dollar Tree. This is for Tuesday, January 17th, 2023. I went out of town this week, so we went to stores located in Houston and in Dallas, Texas this week. So let's go shopping. We're going to start with apparel and accessories first. We've got these new hats. They are a toddler size in mint green. It says they're called the Layer 8 UPF 40 Plus, and it is a girl's hat. The tag says they were originally $20, just $1.25 now at the Dollar Tree. There's also some new tote bags. We've got this one in the blue, the red, and then we have an orange one with the feathers. Over in Arts and Crafts, we have a few new things to show you, like the Vinyl Weed Collector. This is for weeding vinyl. Um, and you've got those little scraps. It suction cups to the table. It's got this little opening here to help you remove the scraps. And it comes in three different colors, a light blue, green, and red. They also had this pack of multicolored tan and brown beads. And then the 10 inch wreaths, they come with the round beads and the square beads now in the natural color. We've also got these wood pallet vertical signs. They have them in horizontal signs as well, like this boho one, which I just love because these have the frame already on the front and the hanger on the back, and they're quite large. You could get them in the boho style, the brown and the white wood pallet look. They're about 15 to 16 inches long, or you can get these wood pallet pieces in brown, white, and black. They're at least a half inch or bigger um, in thickness, and they're quite nice. They were just called decor on the back. When I measured them at home, they measure about seven inches long. And again, they come in three different colors, about half inch thick. Wonderful for crafting. There were these crafter square wood slices. It's a 120 gram pack. They're cut at the diagonal. They look like a nautical style piece of wood, almost like driftwood. They're about two inches long. And then these wood dowels have a nautical look to them as well. And they measure about three inches long. We've got these large farmhouse signs that are on the stand so you either get the black um, painted cow the rooster or the pig and then that wood pallet house um, it is by itself it comes with the hangers so you've got the wood pallet look um, in the white here's a view of it from the back and you could also purchase it in black wood grain or the brown wood grain and I found these farmhouse tags that you can DIY. They have a um, natural wood, the white or black with the natural color beads at the top. And then the white and black beads, those have a little um, design at the bottom. They have these tags that are galvanized metals. We've got the farm or you can get the three farm animals. It's got the rooster, the pig, and the cow. They also had these vinyl stickers that say blessed family with the sunflowers. They measure nine inches long. It's the Crafter Square brand. They're double-sided. So on the back, that one says thankful. And then this one says gather home with the greenery. And on the other side, it says love. And you get three different color feathers. They also had the um, tomato cage style wreath forms and these kids DIY fashion Barbie accessories. You can make a tie dye Barbie dress. It comes with the markers, the directions and a water pipette along with the dress and some other kits like these bracelet making um, pop and wear bracelets. They had Minnie Mouse, uh, Gabby's Clubhouse and My Little Pony. And now for the health and beauty, we'll start with the cosmetics. There were these new City Collection. It's the City Color Collection Highlighter. It's a cream highlighter and a powder highlighter. And all the different shades are listed on the back of the box. They have like two or three different shades that you could purchase. I found this Maybelline New York Master Chrome Jelly Highlighter in a 9.5 ounce jar. There's also... Uh, these bins here that have um, the single eyeshadow 
colors from NYX Professional Makeup. They had a couple different colors that you could purchase. And then I found some CoverGirl eyeshadow palettes as well. Um, this one is the blue purple coloring and it has like directions on the back to do with the numbers there on the front. And then there were these Maybelline Python metallic lip uh, colors as well. I also found some Be Pure Hydrating Lip Oils. These are the infused with like a rose oil. They're in the Valentine's Day print. They have the 12 piece nails with the metallics on the outside in some matte color nail color. Um, and there's a couple different designs, really pretty. You do have to purchase the glue um, to attach these. Over in the hair care on Friday, I showed you guys they had these really pretty headbands in the satin with the white trim. They had them in several colors like purple, rose, green, and black. I found the matching scrunchies this week and they had those in all four colors. And of course, they've got that little white trim around the outside so it will coordinate with that uh, scrunchie. There were these scrunchies with the cheetah print in blue and the natural cheetah print design. There's also these velour headbands with the extra large uh, pearls on the outside. They had that in a burgundy and hunter green. There's also these gold barrettes with the um, kind of like hammered look. They have a resin barrette with pearls and rhinestones. They've got the alligator style clips in the gold. And then the two pack of bobby pins with the circles on the end that have the rhinestones attached. So you could either get the rhinestones or the pearls that say love. The pharmacy and personal care items, they have these new pumice stones. You get three different ones that you can choose from. They're like a Valentine's Day theme. They also had some new nail files and a heart shape. So they say XOXO heart shape. They have the... Um, Lipstick lips and then there's also the cheetah print. Those are all the backing and then the pumice stone is on the other side They come on a plastic stick and it has a hanger on the bottom The nail files you get three in a pack and those are all the heart shape and they coordinate with the pumice stone designs there's the ex um, expression uh, Band-aids that come in this plastic pouch with the clips you can hang it on like a gym bag our first aid kit. They also had the Karis skin tone fabric bandages in again. There were the Sweet Vanilla Rose Bolero Bar Soap. It's plant derived. And then they also have some of the rose scented and lavender scented bars of soap that are kind of designed for Valentine's Day. There's the Freeman Feet uh, salt scrub for your feet. And then they also have the uh, moisturizing foot treatment masks. Now for the fun finds, we have these new LED lights that say I am very busy. They are on a stand that lights up. It already comes with the batteries. It changes colors very subtly. Subtly, they have seven colors that it cycles through. It's got the button cell batteries already attached. And inside there's, you don't have to buy any. It has a little on off switch on the bottom there. And as you can see, it just lightly and slowly changes through the different colors, um, which is nice that they don't flash. You could actually remove the writing off of these and pull the plastic piece off. It comes right off. You could use these in your Cricut. You can change the wording with some stickers. There's just lots of different ways you could design these. There's also some keychains with the sequins or uh, kind of glitter inside. They have a smiley face, a unicorn, and a rainbow. And now let's move over into the home decor to see what's new over there this week. We've got these photo frames by Special Moments. It is the four by six inch frame. They're pretty much like an easel style um, plastic piece on the bottom in white and black, and then it's frameless at the top. You just slide the photo down inside. They also had these glass balls that say thankful and family. It's kind of like a farmhouse Ray Dunn style. Um, they are ceramic. We've also got these ceramic uh Orbs here. They've got the white and the black with different designs on them. One's matte, one's a glossy finish. These really pretty iridescent vases. They also had the clear vases that you could DIY. 
just in time for Valentine's Day. And then these small glass containers that say date night and love, and they have a cork top. They also had the glass ceramic cameras, really pretty decorations for a shelf. There's two different designs. We've got the ceramic dogs in the black and white. Some are matte finish, some are glossy. They also have the cats and the swans. The swan, one of them holds a tea light candle. The other one, the um, heads make a heart. And then we've got the rooster and matte. And then one of them is a lamb, has these little decorative designs on the side. And that is a matte finish. There's also the ring holders that say in a world where you can be anything. They have one that says you are gold baby, solid gold. Uh, this one with the unicorn, it says you, I think it says nice. And then keep calm and shine bright, happily ever after. These are the double-sided trinket trays. My heart, your love with the heart locket and the key. And then a heart and a ring. Now for the office supplies, home library and teaching tree section. We have these novelty pens with the plastic topper there. It's got some glitter style sequence in there. Uh, we have the pink, the green, and the purple. There's also these jot binder clips in the rose gold. You get eight and that coordinates with a lot of the things I've been showing you over the last few weeks with the um, new wall units they have in the rose gold and all the accessories. We have some new paper trays and a light kind of like a melon kind of pink color and this really pretty sunburst orange. They also had the Clean Earth Westcott scissors. These are made out of the recyclable materials. They have several different colors to choose from. And then the storage, electronics, automotive, and housewares. They have some new phone cases with a hand strap with these clear hearts, which I thought was really pretty. Tells you what size phones they fit on the front. We've also got these LED light sets. You get 10 lights in green, blue, red, and purple. And then the mini trash cans for your car. They come in black, red, green, and yellow. They also had these large mouse pads. They had them in about three or four different sizes and a couple different designs. I also found some more of these bins with the flower cutouts in the sides. So some of them have the pink, green, blue, and light gray. And then some of them have, it's like a melon, a light pink, a blue, and a light gray. So they kind of go, uh, just depends on which store you're at. Some of them have the green. Some of them have the two different colors of pink. Just really depends on where you're at. They have them in a bunch of different sizes and designs. Some have the farmhouse kind of looking basket, like this one here, with the larger openings. And then the smaller locker style bins. And those have the cutout handles in the sides. They also have the bins that have the snap on lids. So there's a bunch of different ones. And again, the color schemes just kind of depends on which store you're at. Over in kitchen and pantry, they had these magnetic succulents. I thought these were so cute to put on the refrigerator. They have a couple different styles and designs. They look like they've all been hand painted. I think the yellow one is probably my favorite. It has like yellow and little sunbursts of like a darker orange and a little bit of green in the middle. I just thought they were really well painted, really pretty. They also had these ceramic magnets. And there were two different ones that I found. And now for the party supplies. They've really been putting out a lot of their cake and cookie decorating items recently. Lots of icing gels and a bunch of different colors. They also have the frosting gel tubes for like cupcakes. And then all of the um, decorating items that you would need. Piping bags. Um... Just a whole bunch of different items. They had the um, bag fillers with the shreds. They've got those in the red, 
the white iridescent and silver for Valentine's Day. Also a bunch of new wrapping paper, a lot of floral patterns and polka dots and the lighter pastel spring colors. And now for the pet care. They put out some more of these food bowl placemats. Um, it's hard to tell by the picture, but they're in a really light sage green and a soft blue. They almost look gray, but in person they are blue and green. We also have the dog toys that say melt my paw and the little squirrels and teddy bears holding a heart for Valentine's Day. And now for the seasonal items, we'll start with Valentine's Day first. So we have these red truck socks. They're red and pink. Those are the knee-high socks. They also had some gnomes. These are the taller socks. Also the ones with the um, conversation hearts. And then the crew socks. We have some more gnomes and lips and hearts on the outside. They had some fluffy socks with the lips. Some that say love. And then different sayings with hearts and kissy faces, things like that. They also had some new um, scarves. We've got the gnomes. They had some buffalo plaid, a bunch of different heart patterns that say love. The buffalo plaid, some of them I found them in the infinity scarves and then just the long straight scarves. They also had the red trucks. I found some animals like dogs and hedgehogs. They've got the large tote bags with the red trucks that say, Be My Valentine, and some sunglass or eyeglass cases that say things like, Choose Kindness, XOXO, the gold with the XOXO and some hearts, and then just some different Valentine's Day colors and patterns. They had some sequence bags in pink, and they change over into silver. They also had some burlap bags that say you are possum and purple, hugs and red and pink, just love in the red and white, and then love with the red and white. There's also some candle votives with the wood tags that say love. They had them in light pink, dark pink, purple, and white. I think the one light pink one is supposed to be red. It's kind of hard to tell. They also had their pool noodles in the white, dark pink, and red. Their balloons, their self-sealing um, valves. They go up to like six inches um, for each letter there. And they end up being like 22 inches long. They have some new wall decor like love is in the air with the hot air balloon. Love with the rainbow and clouds. They also have the sweet love cupcake. And happy Valentine's Day with the rainbow heart. Some velvet ribbon. This is like a two inch ribbon. Dark pink, light pink, white, black, and red. Some more Valentine's Day signs. A couple different ones here. The XO with the galvanized metal. And that's just a shelf sign. They have one that says love. There's also... The um, novelty signs, they have like a unicorn. There's a sloth holding a heart, a dragon, and a koala bear. And they had these large tags that say XO with the buffalo plaid. In the back, the DIY signs that say kiss me. They also have forever and always. And then the DIY happy Valentine's Day sign. Some more of the yard stakes that have the conversation hearts. There's four of them. The galvanized metal sign they had out last year with the gnomes on the front. And then the gnomes with the red truck. There's also the red, white, and pink votives with the candles. We have the kissing booth. The little sign in the front turns around. So it says hugs a dollar or kisses 25 cents. There's also a kissing booth with the dog. It says kisses for free or love forever. The 
the red and white one says kissing booth with a pug wearing glasses. It says have a bite or one smooch. And then we have these um, sequins or kind of tinsel hearts and a little potted plant there. The beaded hearts that say hug with the beads at the top. These large jumbo craft um, foam hearts. Uh, these are just the DIY white foam hearts. They're quite large. I put them up next to the large um, hearts that they have the glitter on so you can compare the sizes. Then I found some more of the wreath um, rails that they have out. And I'll show you guys a picture of what those are supposed to look like decorated in just a minute here. So now for the Easter items, we have the molds. They have the bunny uh, bottoms with the feet. They have the vase fillers. They're starting to put out also the wreath form that looks like a bunny head with the ears and the carrot. I also found some of the pom-poms in blue and white. I'm sorry, yellow. They have the carrots that they've had out the last few years and then the stuffed bunny uh, on a dowel rod. They've got those in the blue and in the pink and they brought back the gingham headbands. Uh, bunny ears in the pink and the blue. They also had the Tale of Peter Rabbit book and a few other small board books with the bunnies on the front. There's also these large plastic bins, bunny kisses, Easter, shake your cotton tail, the pink one and the blue one says bunny trail. And now for the St. Patrick's Day items. They had these really cute gnomes. Um, I found these two. There's one more. They're supposed to be a girl, but they were sold out already. They have these really long legs. They sit on a shelf. There's also the large gnomes. These are 10 inches. And then we have these large burlap flags. They say happy St. Patrick's Day with the leprechaun hat. Lucky me with the pot of gold, St. Patrick's Day. And kiss me, I'm Irish with the green truck that says loads of luck. And we've got a gnome in the back. So cute. We've also got the tinsel pot of gold that says lucky. Some more of the wood bead garland for St. Patrick's Day. It has the white green and dark green beads. We've got a gnome on the bottom of one of them and he's holding a shamrock. And then we've just got the white and green beads for these little tassels here. And they, here's a view of it from the side so you can see it a little bit better. They've got a pot of gold at the end of one of them. One has a leprechaun hat. There's also the rainbow with a shamrock and a cloud or the shamrock that says lucky. They also have these tinsel gnomes with the red or orange beards. There's a view of the top. It has two different hats. There's two different gnomes you can get. This one has a body and little feet. The other one's just the head. And he has a buffalo plaid hat on. We've got the shelf um, horseshoes. So cute. It says happy St. Patrick's Day and welcome. Neither the natural wood or the white. And they're about an inch thick. They're quite nice. They're painted all the way around and on the sides. So this um, is a little craft kit. You get a bunch of shamrocks and it's one of those scraping kits you can use to decorate um, with the little craft stick and it's called Scratch Art. I believe you get seven in each pack. There's a couple different ones you could purchase. We've got the low cut gnome socks with the buffalo plaid uh, black and green hats. They're holding a shamrock. We've got the flowers with the gold coins and the um, new wreath rails that they had for Valentine's Day. So we've got the clovers that they love, a gnome, and a truck with a shamrock. And this is what they look like decorated. You just put the um, deco mesh along the rail there instead of in a wreath form. We've got these small decorative signs that say Irish at heart, happy St. Patrick's Day, 100% Irish. And then we've got like the pot of gold there. They also have the Kiss Me I'm Irish and it looks like a mason jar with some galvanized metal at the top. 
for the spring items. I showed you guys on Friday, they had these new Be Humble and Be Kind wood palette signs. They have some new planters that are black with the yellow trim, the white with the yellow trim, or you can get the yellow with the black trim. There's also some new floral gardens ribbon. You get nine feet. You've got the yellow and black stripes. There's also the solid sheer yellow, the wire on the ends, and the polka dots. Those are all wired ribbon. We've got the glass gnomes and the stepping stones. I just showed you guys these on Friday. Here's the stepping stones. It's kind of all the items I found put together. They also have these metal pails that look like a bumblebee. Here's a view from the side with the handles. And then we've got the wreath forms. We've got the um, beehive and the bee. Those are the wire wreath forms. I also found these DIY craft bee wall decal that you can decorate. And there are two different ones. I found some ladybug ribbon as well. That's the nine feet ribbon. It is two inches wide and they also have the wire in the ends. We've got the stripes, the polka dots, and the sheer. We've got the DIY welcome garden signs. One says welcome, one says garden. And then the mini flower pots, you get three. It's made out of the natural wood and they're in three different sizes. The wood picks, these are the indoor garden collection. So we've got, um, Two flowers, some greenery, and a butterfly. So we've got this greenery here. It's like a 3D wood pick. We've got the flower. There's a view from this side in the back. We also have the butterfly. And a tulip. There's also these craft wood animal picks. I believe you get four in a pack. We've got the frogs, the bunnies, there's snails. We also have hedgehogs. And then the mushrooms. And here's what they look like um, all together. They're quite large, probably about 10 inches long. And again, you get four in a pack. We've got this um, garland with the beads. We have the DIY flower. The yellow beads, the watering cans with the green beads, the um, birds have red beads, and the butterflies have the green beads. Comes with the twine as well. We also have a bumblebee. The beads are yellow. And then a ladybug, and her beads that she comes with are red. We've also got some craft flower ornaments. You get five. Comes with the twine hangers. We have um, three different flowers. There's the second one and the third one. We've also got some galvanized metal signs like the snail. We have a large ladybug. And then the two flower pots with the leaves and the flowers. Also the watering can with the flowers coming out the top. A butterfly and a bumblebee. We've also got this really cute little bird. And the last one is the mushroom. We've also got these flower pots in the purple. It's got this lace decorative topper. They are plastic. And then they also have it in yellow. Some signs for Mother's Day. It says you're the best mom in pink and brave, strong, loved in the blue. Now for toys, games, and entertainment. We've got these wind-up toys. They're like little miniature um, sewing machines. They have a mixer, some vacuum cleaners. They also have a Barbie doll um, closet. It's a fashion doll closet in purple. It says it comes with three hangers. Here's a view of what it's supposed to look like on the inside. They also have some Barbie items. 
This is a travel pack. It has like headphones, sunscreen, a camera, passport, shoes, a bag, a neck pillow, a sun visor, sunglasses, slippers. We also have this outfit. Comes with a shirt and shorts and a fanny pack. And we have this outfit here again. Shirt, short, and some shoes. We've got the chef outfit. Comes with the um, pots and pans. And now we'll go over to the Dollar Tree Plus items, which are the three to five dollar items. For five dollars, we have these large Valentine's Day gnomes. They come in several different skin tones and hair color. They have the boys and the girls. Also, these metal trucks that say, Oh, Sweet Valentine. And then the pink truck that says XOXO. Those are $5 each. The sign here that says You and Me, they're $3 each. We've also got these large um, hanging orbs of roses. The um, Easter gnomes. And then the Easter wreaths on a stand. The welcome one is on the white stand. The blue says Easter blessings, and then the green one has the Easter bunny that says Happy Easter. We saw the first two on Friday. I wanted you guys to see the last one that I found. Also, these little potted um, Easter topiaries. They've got two different um, like little potted plants there, or uh, pots, and then they've got some of the metal bunnies. They got those in like four different colors. It has like an embossed surface. They also have the chicks, and those are $3. This large embossed egg, it's $5. And then the big bottle brush tree style um, carrots, those are $3. These adorable little bunnies holding either flowers or a carrot, they are $5. Here's a view from this side. And then the green topiary bunnies, they are $3, and there's two styles. We also have these large leaning signs for um, Easter. They're $5. And then the stuffed door decor, also the wreath forms. And I believe those are $5 each. It has some chicken wire attached. Then $3 ribbon, we've got the carrots. You get 36 feet of the ribbon, the rainbow ribbon, a bunch with bunnies on it. We've got the natural blue and yellow, and then some buffalo plaid, Easter eggs, and then the solid colors and the pastels. We've also got this Myers Clean Day dish soap for $5 and the hand soap for $5. They have these galvanized metal sun and moon. Those are $3. These large stretched canvas signs, they are $5 each. We have the bridge. Um, this one's supposed to look, I guess, like a kind of like a beach scene. The Eiffel Tower. Some large greenery. And then an abstract. There's also this large wood um, bowl, and that is $3. And that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. Have a great week, everyone.